in acting, if I'm not continuously doing it, I do get really rusty, but when I am doing it, I just feel so good. I decided to do self-tape practice every day in December until Christmas. I filled up this advent calendar with different scenes and monologues from Christmas movies and TV shows. I just really wanted to have fun and make sure that I actually do all of them and stay consistent. So because of that, whenever I select a scene, I set a timer for 15 minutes and that's it as far as preparation. I think it's better to get some practice in than none. It's like going on a 15 minute walk before you go train for a marathon. You know, I just want to get some kind of exercise in for my acting. So let's see what's behind door number nine. Where's door number nine? Oh, right here. A Christmas movie Christmas. I found a lot of gems and this is one of the movies that I definitely want to watch this year, like the whole thing. It just seems like it would be very magical. This is a scene and the scene I'm going to do is I'm playing one of the sisters. There's two sisters who like are single. They live in a big city that's really expensive and then they like wish to have a Christmas movie Christmas and Santa Claus is conveniently there and it's like is that are you sure that's what you want so I'm gonna set a 15 minute timer do a little bit of practice and then we will do a few takes and I'll show you the best ones I recorded the audio of the movie and I just edit it so that there's silence where I need to put my lines I usually do it two different ways and I'm trying to give myself a little bit more context a little bit more direction I would love for somebody else to like be here giving me direction but it's a self tape practice I can't have an actual director every time I'm doing practice for one of the takes I want to do that it is just like a bubbly full of energy Christmas spirit person who just loves Christmas and she believes in the magic of Christmas so much that this wish of hers comes true and then the other one's going to be somebody who's over christmas because she's had so many bad christmases that she's like oh i used to love it as a kid but now it's terrible like that vibe and i'm trying to do the acting as the rhythm and the vibe and the everything of an actual christmas movie so i'm gonna do my best to only do one or two takes of each version my eyeline is gonna be right here cool and i'm outside so i'm cold adorable <laughs> What's the next line? Take three. Okay, that one was okay, but maybe let's just try one more and that's it. Now I'm going to attempt to just do one take of the other one, because this first take took me a few times just because it's like I'm almost off book and then I kept messing up on one line. Anyways, that's what I get for only preparing it for 15 minutes and not wanting to look at a paper, but um, let's see if I can do it once without messing up. I actually did it. So here are the two takes that I thought were the best ones. I'll see you tomorrow. I honestly don't know if I can take one more Christmas movie. What do you mean? Everybody loves Christmas movies. They're sweet and heartwarming. And predictable. And they, <sighs> they meet. They fall in love. It snows. The end. Don't be such a scringe. A scringe? Yeah. Scrooge plus Grinch. Scringe. Life isn't a Christmas movie. But why can't it be? I would be so good at a Christmas movie. I'm quirky yet lovable. And I... Adorable. You know, you could use a Christmas movie to warm that cold, cold heart. It's not a cold heart, Eve. It's just a worried one. What are you worried about? It's almost like, like you're hiding away from real life. So what if I am? I mean, look at us, Lacey. We're both single. We live in an apartment we can barely afford. We have to go outside to get warm. My boss doesn't even know my name or what I do. And my Christmas cookies are burnt. And you? Well, I'm pretty sure you've dated every jerk in the city. <sighs> True. The new one's moving every day. <laughs> you know, I wish we could have a perfect Christmas. Like those from the movies. The ones with beautiful decorations, a grandma who cooks, a handsome beau. <sighs> What are you talking about? Everybody loves Christmas movies. They're sweet and heartwarming. And predictable. <sighs> they meet, they fall in love, it snows. <laughs> the end. Don't be such a scringe. A scringe? Yeah, Scrooge plus Grinch. Scringe. Life isn't a Christmas movie. But why can't it be? I would be so good at a Christmas movie. I'm quirky, yet lovable. Hopeless, yet adorable. <laughs> You know, you could use a Christmas movie to warm up that cold, cold heart. It's not a cold heart, Eve. It's just a worried one. What are you worried about? It's almost like, like you're hiding away from real life. 
I mean, look at us, Lacey. We're both single. We live in an apartment we can barely afford. You have to go outside to get warm, and my boss doesn't even know my name or what I do, and my Christmas cookies are burnt. You, you've probably dated every jerk in the city, so... True. <sighs> but new ones move in every day. <laughs> I just wish we could have a perfect Christmas, you know? Like the ones in the movies. The ones with beautiful decorations. A grandma who cooks. And a handsome bow. <laughs>